Meanwhile, <clears throat> the crowds in Virginia yesterday. Boy, that violence was something else, right? Wow. Just yeah, you, you knew these people. Control. When they had guns, they were going to use them. Because mm-hmm. that's just what gun people do. That's right. They have guns and they're itching to shoot somebody with it. <laughs> and so that's why the piles of dead bodies everywhere in the street. Uh, actually, none of that happened. There, nope. I, I don't think there was a single arrest of a of a gun advocate. Uh, there was one arrest. Okay. And it was a lady who was wearing a oh, mask. Oh, yeah, she wore Yeah, right. And I don't and know that she- a temporary mask ordinance where you can't wear one at the thing. Was she actually a gun advocate, though? Was that I don't the, know. Yeah, That's we don't even point. know that. That's a good point. We don't even know that. Yep. Here's a look at the, the crowd that was there, though. It was pretty sizable. <laughs> Pretty sizable wow. indeed. Now, police said there were 22,000 people there. Okay. They were expecting, I think they were expecting 50. Um, yeah, I don't know how many people we ended up. Uh... But I don't know. That's what they're saying, 22,000 people. You know, they, they shortchanged us big time when we did the rally in D.C. So, who knows? There could have been 50,000 or 60,000 there. I, I don't know. Um. Boy, that looked like more than 22,000. It looks like a lot of people. Yeah, because it, it, it was a really it, good turnout. It went for blocks and blocks. Um, yeah. I it, loved it. It was huge. And and I, I want to, um, the governor there, uh, what's his name? Northam. Northam, Northam yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, how he, he went on Twitter yesterday evening, and, and he thanked his team, or he thanked the teams uh, for, for keeping, uh, keeping the peace, you know, keeping the peace. He gave no credit Gave no credit to the citizens of his state that showed up and peacefully protested. No, no, no. Thank, thanks for uh, thanks for keeping uh, everything under control. Um, That's great. Yeah, so yeah. Uh, just terrible. And- Obviously, peace-loving people who mm-hmm. are gun owners showed up because there was no violence. And that's what everybody, they desperately wanted violence. Oh, yeah, there was this they one, wanted it. one reporter I saw on Twitter who said... Uh, what is so striking about the scene at the gun rights rally in Richmond is what you don't see. Almost no cops. Just that little cluster of state police there. No lines of riot cops, no law enforcement in riot gear. So I tweeted back at her. I'm hoping to hear back. I wanted to go and do a report on an Antifa protest in Portland. And um, be mm. sure to uh, compare and contrast what you saw in Richmond as to what you <laughs> yeah. see in Portland. That's I'm sure, sure we'll hear back. Oh, I'm sure. Uh, CNN actually... Did a pretty good job reporting on it. Yeah. Uh, here's what they had to say. CNN Sarah Seiner, she's standing by. She's been in the mix amongst the demonstrators all morning. Sarah, what have you been seeing and hearing today? Look, those threats which caused the governor to call for a state of emergency have simply not emerged. The police very clear in saying that they have not had a single arrest uh, during this rally. And we've been standing here all morning since the very beginning. Uh, There are thousands, if not tens of thousands of people here. I want to give you a view. Uh, We are standing right outside of the area where you go in um, to the Capitol there. And what you'll see um, are just throngs of people Hmm. lining not just this street, but all the streets around the Capitol. There are folks that are there to lobby their legislatures because this is actually lobby day where they are trying to tell them how upset they are with some of the gun restrictive laws that they are looking to pass. That's it's amazing. That's a fair report right and there. And that was probably the last report that that reporter filed for CNN before getting her <laughs> pink slip. Well, you can't you can't be fair. Mm-hmm. No. Not to these gun nuts. Don't don't tell us the facts. By the way, those threats, if I'm not mistaken, were um, a group of seven guys that were going to show up. Seven guys. And as far as I know, I don't know if they did or did not. But that was what caused all of the mm. angst. In Richmond, so incredible. Good, good job and, by the citizens of the state. Yeah, that's that's awesome. And you knew it was going to be that way with with reasonable gun rights people, just good patriotic citizens. 